Hello, CloudSolvedIT.com users. I'm Martin Montoya, and uh, we're here to talk about Chromebook and backup. So I've done a video segment for my users regarding how to configure all of your office settings on your Chromebook. And it's not the most time consuming process in the world, but you know, it can take you 20 to 30 minutes to go in, get all the apps, download them, sign into everything, and get everything working just the way you want it. So what happens if the Chromebook craps out, or if there's a hardware problem, or if you need to back up and recover the device in some way? The, uh, the focus of this video tutorial today is going to be Chromebook backup. Requirements in order to make this happen, you need a few things. You need your Google account, you need a USB drive in excess of four gigs, you need the Chromebook recovery utility, which is available in the Chrome store. And you also need the model number of your particular unit. Mine happens to be a C101P. It's an Asus, I noted it. Uh, it's gonna be somewhere on the casing of your device. Okay, with that being said, let's uh, start our screen sharing up. Let me start my AirParrot app here so you can see what I'm doing on the Chromebook. And Let's connect to the big screen. Voila, there. Now you can see exactly what I'm doing on my Chromebook. Um, I already have a Google account set up on this. Uh, you need one in order to configure these devices. If you need help getting your Google account set up, please feel free to give us a call. I'm assuming you've already got one or we probably wouldn't have gotten this far in the video. With that, I'm gonna start by opening up Chrome. And I found the easiest way to find this utility is Chromebook recovery, there you go, recovery utility. It's gonna bring us to the App Store. I'm gonna click on this, Chrome Web Store. And I, I already have the, the extension installed. Uh, normally you're gonna see a get app in the top right corner since I've already gotten it. I'm just going to go with launch app. To get started with the uh, utility setup, Let's get our handy dandy USB drive. It's gonna tell you right there, it says you need four gigabytes or larger USB flash drive or SD card that you don't mind erasing. Important, if you plug this into this device and we set this up, it will wipe out the contents of the thumb drive or SD card because it has slots for both. I'm gonna get started by putting this thumb drive in here because that's what I'm going to use. And I'm gonna click the guest started link here. Now it wants us to identify the Chromebook. This is where your model number comes in handy. Uh, I've already tried to search for my model number. It actually doesn't show up. Sometimes it's easier to just say, select model from list. With that, I can select a manufacturer. So this is an Asus and I can select a product. I know that it's a C101 PA flip. So I'll grab that. So I've got Asus model number, Thumb drive, I'm gonna hit the continue button here. And it's gonna ask me what I want to use. I actually have a, an SD card in here because I was doing some video shoots, but we're gonna skip on that. I'm gonna grab the InnoStore 16 gig thumb drive because that's what I got in there. And let's hit continue. Create recovery image, create now. So it's actually erasing the contents of this USB drive. It is downloading the recovery image for the Chromebook and it is making a copy of my data. And it's gonna merge those items together and store it on this USB drive so if anything bad were to happen to this Chromebook, I can pop the drive in and I can restore it from the backup. The beautiful thing about it is is that we'll reinstall all of your applications, all of your settings, just the way you left it the day that, uh, actually, when, when you stopped using it, because all that data lives in the cloud. Um, this is probably gonna take a few more minutes and we don't need to sit here and watch it, because I'm gonna do a separate video segment on how to recover from the thumb drive, and I'm also gonna do another video segment on how to power wash your Chromebook, i.e. it's a uh, handy dandy way to wipe out everything that is on it, so you can hand it off to another user in your organization, or perhaps even a family member. So, not too bad of a process to recap. You need that Google account, you need a thumb drive greater than four gigs, you need the Chromebook recovery utility, and you need your Chromebook, Chrome, Chromebook model number. 
Uh, and with those four pieces of information and uh, software, you'll be able to get your Chromebook backed up to a thumb drive or an SD card in no time flat. I want to thank you all for taking the time to watch this Chromebook backup utility video. My name is Martin Montoya and I'm with CloudSolved IT. Please like, follow, or even leave a comment below telling us what kinds of videos you want us to make for you to use in the cloud. Again, I'm Martin Montoya with CloudSolvedIT.com, serverless solutions that work.